Hello everyone, in this video I am going to show you that how you can connect with the Stripe chat support. So basically if we are getting any technical issue or we have the transaction issue, so Stripe team is available for us to solve those type of issues. So I will be showing you step by step that how you will be connecting with the chat support and the good news is that they are available immediately. For example, you just uh, sent a message and within seconds you will be getting the reply. So this is the best thing because in the PayPal, if you are sending them email, you have to wait for two or three more days and then after you will be getting the reply. So that is the bad thing. So in Stripe, you will not face such type of issues. So if you are connecting with the chat support, then immediately you will be getting the reply from their team member. And if you have any issue, then immediately they will be suggesting you the specific solution for that. So let's get started. So first of all, you should go to stripe.com and then on right top corner, you will be getting a sign in option. So let me sign into my Stripe account. Here we need to add our email address and password and then need to click on continue. So here we need to do the two step authentication. You will be getting a specific OTP one time password, which you have to use and then you will be logged into your Stripe account. So you will have to wait for a while until you are getting any specific message onto your mobile phone on a specific mobile number. So once you are logged into your Stripe dashboard, then you will be getting such informations and now we are interested to connect with the chat support only. So what you need to do is you need to open a new tab and then after you have to search here Stripe chat support. All right. So once you are going to search that thing, then you have to click on the first link 24 by 7 phone and chat support. Then, then after you have to scroll it down and you will be getting an option of contact us. So you have to click over it and you will be redirected to this page. So here we have help and support, media and press and there are a couple of other options. So in we are interested to help and support. So we have to click on get started. Now we have, if we have any simple question to ask, then we can also search here and they will have even given the reply in the community. So if we are getting the solution from that specific description of the problem, then that's good. Otherwise we can connect with them uh, through chat or maybe the phone. So what we need to do here is we need to go ahead and click on contact support. So here you can see that we have this support pop up over here and we need to select a specific topic. So for example, we have a dispute, we have a financial report, login issues, connect, <coughs> payment APIs, payouts, refund, and there are a couple of other options. So I have to ask the Stripe team that my international uh, transactions are not enabled and what's the, uh, what's the uh, way? So let me click on connect. And here we have a couple of options which are email us, have you call us, and can chat with support. So basically, if you are interested to email with email to them, then you can also click over here. So first example, I'm clicking over here and this is opened in the new tab. And here you can see that we have account, specific account of your Stripe. For example, I have two accounts of the Stripe. Here you can see that we have this one and this one. And I'm interested to select this one and then we have specific uh, category of the issue. So you should select over here and then you should uh, uh, ask the question here. 
so what is your question so you should uh, click over here and do, then then after you should upload a file if you have any and if you don't have any file i mean screenshot of the error or maybe other things uh, and you should also explain a specific thing over here and then after you should click on send email all right and if you are not interested to do the email then you can also connect with the chat support so for say example i am clicking on chat with support and here you can see that they have written here estimated wait time about three minutes so within three minutes you will be connected to one of the guy so i am uh, just writing here hi so once i will be sending this message within a short period of time yeah you can see that mav has joined so there is a some uh, there is one guy who connected with me and he is just uh, he has just started the chatting with me all right so this is mav from stripe support team how are you doing today i am doing good thanks how are you mav so then after we can actually uh, write them a message that we are facing such type of issues so for example i am asking him that uh, can you please can you please check why my internet uh, that that i can accept international transactions so in such a way you can do the uh, connection uh, you can make a connection with the stripe support team and they will be immediately giving you the reply they will be connecting with your backend system and they will be checking that if they have any uh, type of issue so they will be trying their best to uh, solve such type of issues all right so if you are also thinking that you have such type of issues and you can also solve these and even you can if you are searching on the internet you will be getting couple of articles uh, written uh, by the stripe itself for supporting their customers all right the chat support is the best support uh, provided by the stripe itself uh, i am not sure so actually uh, they are asking me the, some, some questions i will be giving the, them the reply so you can see that they have given me uh, the suggestion that if i may ask have you already entered set up the international settings muhammad so they have also written can you please send me the screenshot of what you are seeing in your international setting so actually i was not aware about the international setting so let me go to my international settings so i have to search here international so here you can see that we have the international setting so once i will be opening this then you can see that i have missed something so some information is missing if i am clicking on edit you can see that i have not added my company identification number and that's why i am getting the issue so in the same way they will be giving the solution they will be helping us to know about the specific problem and then definitely we can solve those issues immediately and you can see that this is one of the smallest issue for us but we were also suffering from a lot of problems that what there may be any other cause but you can see that the the chat support has immediately helped us to know about uh, the company number so i have written here that asking for company number to enter so make sure that you should give uh, you should not give the access to uh, any uh, any other person for uh, related to your uh, stripe account because if in that way they can also uh, connect with the chat support and disable your or maybe de deactivate your stripe accounts so for now that's it so if you are thinking that this video was useful just click on the like button and also subscribe this channel because in the coming videos i will be uh, coming with a new and better concept for you so that you get the benefit out of it so once again thank you so much for watching this video see you in the next one